Knock, knock. Who's there? Justin. Justin who? Justin, time for the show. See, on days like this, I miss Jam. Too bad she left you for tea, okay? Unwillingly, that is. Sure, whatever helps you sleep at night. holiday coming up uh, you know i don't know i give up oh my gosh kareen it's saint patrick's day oh yeah the day we honor saint patrick a patron saint of ireland okay miss wikipedia wait is it miss armbruster doing something in the comments today for saint patrick's day Yup, today during lunch, there will be a discussion of the history of Ireland and St. Patrick's Day, in addition to a dive into Irish culture with a live performance by Finn Wilson. You can join in person or virtually with the Google Meet nickname Lucky One. Slante! Wait, why aren't you wearing green? You know what you and Jaina have in common? What green? Y'all always in my business. I thought you were going to say we both love history. Oh my gosh, what a coinka dink. I like history too. What I love more than history? Odell Beckham, getting your nails done. Odell Beckham, getting your hair did. No, it's definitely Odell Beckham, ain't it? No, cooking. Um, well, see, I don't cook. I'm more of an eating and tasting type of gal. Maybe that'll change after this segment, Cooking with Chris. Hola, niños. So, today, I teach you all how to cook. Seniors are going to college. Yeah, next year. Let's be honest. You're all going to be broke. So, I'm here today to help you guys cook like a master chef. Listen, I got you guys. We're going to be making uh, Alfredo. Watch me work. I don't even know where I have to get. I'm going to wing it. Yeah. Great segment, Chris. But I'm still a eating and tasting, but mainly eating type of gal. I agree. Just thinking about food makes me want to do my happy dance. Wait, do you have a happy dance? Yeah, um, I'm gonna need you to tweak that like a lot. Bit before dance marathon comes around because we don't do that around here. Speaking of dance marathon, here's a segment by yours truly. On April 1st, Dance Marathon at Suncoast will hold their virtual event. Members of the club have been actively getting donations throughout the school year. There have been multiple community nights held at various restaurants where a percentage of the proceeds have been donated to Dance Marathon. There is a $50 minimum to attend the event and students are encouraged to reach out and raise as much money as possible. 
last year's event was held in person and $46,060.37 were raised. Here is Dance Marathon's director, Madeline Caruso, with more information. Hi, my name is Madeline Caruso and I'm a co-director for Dance Marathon with Anna Stengel. I got involved with Dance Marathon for the children at Shands Children's Hospital in Gainesville, Florida. And I also think it's really interesting that we get to work with University of Florida and learn new fundraising strategies and leadership skills that will stay with us for the rest of our lives. Being a director this year is super different with COVID, but I think it's really fun that we are able to get together on Google Meets, meet up at community nights, and take part in different and fun virtual events and activities. I think we're all super excited for our event on April 1st, and we're doing this all for the kids. Make sure to join the Google Classroom, follow the Instagram, and sign up for the Remind if you want to get involved. This has been Lauren for WRSN. Speaking of dancing, name one event where dancing is a requirement. Birthday parties. Yup. Now let's see what charges will be celebrating their birthdays this week. Happy birthday, Chargers. Now, let's go to Derek with Philview. What is up, you guys? It's your boy Derek, better known as King Taxi on YouTube. Today we're back at it again with yet another episode of Field View. Today we're going to be going around asking, what is everyone doing for spring break? Let's get it. I'm gonna sleep and get a haircut. Uh, I'm going to an island. An island? Yeah. I like the soccer ball. Uh, I'm going to Chicago to visit my family. Ah, oh, that sounds kind of fun. I will be playing D and D with these guys. Ah, that sounds fun. Uh, to, for spring break, I think my family has plans of going to like a mountain cabin in, in, in Georgia, Tennessee, or North Carolina. We're still looking for cabins, but we are not sure. However, for the first part of our holiday, we should we, we are probably going to go to Fort Myers to see some family. I'm going to Siesta Key. Spring break, I'm going to just be relaxing, catching up on my work, and just enjoying the break. Yeah, thank you. I will be working all of spring break. All of spring break? Yes, all of spring break. No vacation? No vacation. Uh. Working out, being lazy, and eating. Watching TV. Watching TV. Um, I'm going camping in the Keys. Ah, nice, nice. Uh, I will be going up to New York to tour some colleges and uh, visit family, so, and uh, social distance while I'm up there to ensure that I make sure everyone is safe and doesn't get COVID. Ah, touring college is nice. Playing video games, staying home. Um, I'll just be at the gym. Probably nothing, um, lots of sleeping, eating, um, procrastinating on homework, um, scholarships. No. Sleeping even more, uh, Netflix, uh, being lonely, oh. Uh, going to arcades. So over spring break, I'm gonna completely relax and I'm actually going to Pennsylvania to visit my college campus for the next year, four years. Oh, nice. nice. I'm going camping. <laughs> I'm going to Russia to hang out with Putin. Nice. I'm going to what? Uh, I'm just gonna be relaxing, you know, getting some work done, catching up on some old work, you know. Uh, I might go to Hawaii. For real? Yeah, I'm not sure though. We're just talking about it. I'm gonna potty train my cat so she doesn't poop everywhere. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Valid Victorian. How are you doing today? I'm We're coming around right. asking, what will you be doing for spring break? I'm just gonna relax, I guess. And study? I'll try not to. Smarty pants. Valid Victorian. Um, probably working out and sleeping a lot more than working out. Ah, nice, nice. All right, so what's up? Okay, we're coming around today asking, what will you be doing for spring break? Okay, so for spring break, I'm going to Texas to get me some new pair of socks. It's these special socks, they don't got holes in them. And I, I need to get those, because they, they special, no holes. Okay, okay, okay. This spring break, I will be hanging out with my friends. Ah, nice. I'm going to Tampa. Oh, that sounds nice. What are you going to do? Uh, go to Hard Rock and Bush Gardens. Nice, nice. And Lauren, on behalf of us and all of WRSN, have a great spring break, Chargers.